Hi guys, it's Adam here again. Today was another Clash of Clans episode. We haven't had a video in two days, and we I had really problems with the schedule lately. This is going to be fixed um, probably now. Tomorrow I will have a Minecraft. I was just um, busy and I need to fix the problem. So here we are in our base, and you can see um that actually our mines that might be a little bit hard to see but you can see it that our mines are stacked and the reason is clash of clans is one year old you can now boost all your resource collectors for one week for only one gem each until august 9th so it's really 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 awesome Thank you, super self. Thank you. Let's collect our bad mines, collectors, drills. I'm really liking it. This is really cool. We are going to upgrade this wizard tower and a few walls this episode. And I also have a ton of uh, resources. So, um, it should be very interesting. Let's go raid. Um, so first raid, Nikas's, something like that. Um, um, the, we have all high level, high resource raids today in the episode. Um, but in the last, in the first minute or two, I'm going to talk about stuff which aren't um, what is happening in the game. And then I am going to switch to talk about the footage because I need to talk to you about some stuff before. Or we I can talk about the footage so as you might see um, I am having uh, no webcam in this video and uh, that was kind of worst heel spell ever um, also uh, you might have just uh, you might have noticed um, I'm not sure uh, if you noticed, but it's possible to notice that I am voiceovering it right now. I am not commentating live. It's just a method that I saw that a lot of YouTubers used. They just, um, they sit in front of their computers with their, um, with their recording software on, um, and then they just, when they are just playing and then when they're finding an array they are starting to record and then they voice over it after also dub dub War gaming which is i think my favorite youtuber right now for clash of clans and chief pat which is the most successful youtuber right now for clash of clans um is doing it so i'm going to do it and uh, it's pretty nice um i tr i like voice over it uh, um, I like practiced it, practiced in it, in it a little bit, and I'm quite good. I know how to do it. Uh, so this raid was a little bit of fail. It's ending in a moment, but in the end, it got a pretty, pretty, pretty um, nice results, as you can see them over here 217k and 224k 12 23 trophies two stars and this tiny tiny bonus next raid is luke which is having a lot a lot a lot of resources um and i'm right now checking if it's in the mines and it's more than 1000 um per shot so it's definitely going to be all in the mines. I'm trying to pick what I can and the Burger King got alerted. This is how daddy is calling him. I'm pretty liking it. So I started, I will sometimes call him Burger King and not Barbarian King. So I deployed a few Barbarians at the end, which really was a waste. Uh, so let's deploy a few giants, open it with roll breakers, roll breakers. Then um, let's put a line of barbs behind and the line of archers behind them. And then just spread a few goblins to take all those tasty gold coins. I am raiding with a 
PG Army, which is my army made by me. I am calling him the PG because it's push and get. The strategy is to push with with giants and wall breakers. Then a little bit after um, a wall of barbarians and a wall of archers. And then just when most defenses are die or have low hit points, um, you just drop a few goblins and they take all of the resources. So it's working um, really well. Um, as you can see, I'm getting all of the resources in those attack. Um, I let my troops that I have right now uh, run around a little bit. Maybe they'll have a few shots at that little storage. And they did. Um, but now they won't. So I'm just going to end the battle because we have nothing to get here. 261k gold, 260k elixir, 8 trophies, and this tiny bonus. I really should stop saying tiny bonus. So, next raid is Flip11, and he got the lowest resources um, of the day. Why am I saying resources? I'm always liking to say resources, um, not an accident, but I'm saying it today is a, an accident. Um, I actually checked for clan castle troops over there, which might surprise you because he got no uh, uh, no clan, but it doesn't mean anything. He could have got troops and then left the clan, and the troops are still there. Uh, his Teslas are really, really easy to know where they are. I'm going to use my troops on him on the Burger King uh, uh, 10 barbarians and 10 archers to kill this Burger King and then I'm going to drop three giants and then a lot of archers on those gold mines tasty tasty gold which all of the gold is over there I guessed correctly um and deploy another giant because that one was already dead and I want him to distract the mortar but it isn't working but it's um but it's too late, Morta. All of the gold is gone. And now I am going to elixir and I'm going to use a small trick. One giant and a few archer on, archers on a wizard tower. Most of you probably know it and saw Chief Pat or Play Clash of Clans or Patrick um, using it however you want to call it and you might tell me down in the comments you need to credit chief pat or however you want to call it he have three he got three names and um you can call him in like i guess he'll prefer patrick but then chief pat but he really never used play clash of clans um but just i don't need to credit him because um this method is is from long ago made and he isn't the guy who made it the uh the like the wizard tower is acting like that people have noticed it and the second the day of the game came out even the first i don't know when but chief pat isn't the guy that made it up let's try and get one star real quick and damn i had giants in my clan castle which is the most annoying thing. I probably, if I had 25 giants uh, archers over there, I was probably getting it. Cause you can see I'm pretty close. Um, but I really had only four barbs and two archers left, which is two less, and I'm not going to have enough to get it. So I'm going to lose 23 trophies, which is exactly what I got in the first battle. So it's okay, but I prefer not. I in the end of this. Um, in the end of this video, I am getting, uh, eight trophies, uh, so let's go back to our base, um, and let's request for some troops, my, um, I am a bit thirsty, but it's okay, let's collect our sped collectors in my zoo, I'm so liking it, um, and we're very close to our barbarian king, especially with the sped drill, which is kicking ass so let's upgrade our um wall breakers and 
Ah, sorry, and our wizard tower. And now, um, what am I doing over here? Um, now let's upgrade this wall and this wall and this wall and then five, four, three, two, one, bam! First level eight wall in the game. So, 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 so cool. Third, 3,000 hit points, we can upgrade it to level 9, but we need level 9, town hall for it. So guys, please like, comment, subscribe, check out my channel, like me on Facebook, the links for my channel and for my Facebook are always in the description. Um, so yeah, happy birthday Clash of Clans, thank you Supercell, I'll see you next time, bye bye. Farewell and peace. Not happy birthday, Chief Supercell, but, but, happy birthday, Clash of Clans. You are one year old. Woo!